Anyone can make a mistake, but when it comes to keeping children safe, one mistake and your child is gone. Pick up another one then. Okay, come on. Bye, see. Emma. I'll see you tomorrow, okay? Don't forget show and tell tomorrow. Okay, okay. okay. she says. Bye. Come on up. Bye-bye. How are you tonight? This isn't supposed to happen. A daycare center releases this five-year-old girl to a Fox News employee pretending to be the mother's co-worker. The mother was watching with our crew. Now you're about to see what is supposed to happen. We took our hidden camera inside a different daycare center. Our employee asked for Denise Hanks' two children. A daycare worker wants to check her ID and a list. Her name isn't on the list, so she calls the parent. It's a simple procedure that protects your kids. It's not every day that daycare centers are confronted with strangers trying to pick up kids, but it does happen. Well, you've got two issues there. One is stranger safety, making sure that the child is not abducted. Most abductions happen by a family member. And then the other would be the custody battles, because child care providers sometimes get caught in the middle of those. The bottom line? The daycare should only release your kids to people on an authorized list. I would take them home with me before I'd let somebody else <laughs> take them, so. This security test has taught parents an awful lot about their daycare centers and even more about their children. One parent's daughter said she remembered the stranger even though they'd never met reinforcing the fact that kids need to be reminded what to do in this situation. If a stranger comes up to you and they want you to go with them, what do you say? No. And if children do their part, parents can only hope that the daycare providers do theirs. I was worried about it because, you know, I know that a lot of times it fails. and So I feel like my money's going <laughs> and my kids are safe, you know, so it's good. Licensed daycare centers are supposed to have a release procedure in place. If you don't think it's being followed, test it yourself. Your child's safety is at 